Kane Vaughn spent a lot of time in and out of jail during his life, and now new footage has been released of the late rapper telling police he's gay in hopes of being moved to another cell. Just watch the video. Where's the plumber at? In there? It's the only yeah, thing I've been on with this. Got a problem, I hate it. They supposed to be a Christian deck, but they got a problem with gay people. So because of your sexual orientation, you're requesting protective custody, is that correct? Yes. Okay. I get along with, you know, the straight people in, they have problems over there, just, they got a problem with me. I don't never start nothing. Bala Josh! I'ma fuck you too. You talking to my sister? Tell her I say I love her. Tell her I'm probably gonna go to PC. Tell her I'm gonna go to PC probably. The leaked body cam footage from November 2017 surfaced on social media this week and shows Ken Vaughn informing cops of his sexual orientation in an attempt to be transferred to another area of the jail and receive protective custody. According to reports, the jail move could be connected to his 2014 arrest for being accused of shooting Malcolm Stuckey and wounding two others. In May 2014, Ken Vaughn and his associate Michael Wade reportedly approached Stuckey and two others at a party. Allegedly, Vaughn and Wade began shooting at their victims before fleeing the scene, killing Stucky. In July of that year, the 26-year-old was charged with one count of murder and two counts of attempted murder for the killings. In late 2017, Kim Vaughn was released after witnesses failed to testify against him. Three years later, Kim Vaughn was shot and killed in Atlanta on November 6, 2020. The shooter, Timothy Leakes, who is affiliated with rapper Quando Rondo, was charged with his murder. The killing resulted from a fight between the two rappers outside of a hookah lounge in Atlanta.